New tonight, so many Arizona dreamers are celebrating this news. Yes, and our David Caltabiano spoke with one dreamer who is putting her life on the line to help people during this pandemic. Karen Garcia will tell you America is her home. She's been here since she was four years old. And nowadays, she often feels like she's fighting two battles. As a registered nurse, a deadly coronavirus pandemic, and as a DACA recipient for her legal protections. Two things at once, and it was just very, very overwhelming. And like I said, at work, I already have an emotional stress. And now coming home, I have emotional stress. But tonight, dreamers like Karen are celebrating after the Supreme Court blocked President Trump's efforts to unwind the DACA program. Overwhelming feeling, just like the first time when they brought it around where I started to cry. It was, we still have the opportunity. We still can keep going. We still can keep working and helping people. However, this mother of two knows this isn't going to be the last fight. A small little victory, but the fight is definitely not over. The Supreme Court's decision allows the government to try again. I'm sure this is not the end of it. I'm sure this is just like a band-aid being put on it to calm things down for now. So until the next court date, Karen says she's going to continue providing care for patients during this unforgiving pandemic. Since I became a nurse was to help people and be there for them in difficult times. In Phoenix, David Coltbiano for Arizona's Family.